pick up the fight backstage. The designers yet. All right, so more news on Kanye West. He's been dropped by CAA. Uh, the Jews are sinking their claws into him. He's been dropped by that Italian brand. Adidas is still with him, though. And Johnny Depp's lawyer for that trial, she dropped him. Okay, here's my opinion on, on Kanye West. A lot of people call him a genius. I don't think he's a genius. He has a lot of talent, though. For what he does, he's extremely talented. Not a genius. Like, kind of like Elvis was talented, not a genius. A lot of people just... Calling people geniuses these days is just... They just throw that around. All right? I think Kanye has, like, the it factor. There's something very watchable about him. You know, that factor that you don't quite know where it is, but he's... He's very... He's very viewable. Or whatever that... He's... He's, he's very, um... He has the it factor. All right? Let's just put it that way. But... But... What's what's my opinion of Kanye West as far as this whole this whole thing is concerned? Him versus the Jews and him taking a right conservative stance. The guy's worth like I think a couple billion dollars. And I don't think this is gonna hurt him. I don't think he actually cares whether this hurts him or not. He got dropped. I don't think he's going to be mainstream marketable anymore that's you know i don't think he actually cares about that if he wanted to he could set up his own talent agency he could set up his own he could set up his own anything actually with two billion dollars you could actually set up your, your 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 whole anything but but let me just tell you guys about this whole scenario of kanye versus the jews etc etc right it's obvious that the media is essentially a propaganda mechanism for anybody and everybody. However, over the last 25 years, from 1995 to 2017, the, the blacks, the Jews, and the whites essentially monopolized that mechanism, monopolized the media. All right? Around 2017, social, social media uh, ascended to where it is at this point. Social justice warriors had a footing and in, in, in its grew sense and this whole social justice war movement where everybody has a voice where freedom exists for every single person where freedom of speech for the first time in human history freedom of speech essentially was given to every single person in this country if you had a voice you want a voice you had a voice if you want a voice you had a voice and you can make you can make you can change things. This is the first time in American history, probably human history, where everybody has a voice. First time that freedom of speech is not just something that's quote unquote freedom of speech, but it's, it's real freedom of speech for everybody. And in, in, in the first time, you know, for the last five years since social media take, took over, the first time in the history of this country where freedom of speech exists for everybody. In America, in the world, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Now, Kanye, I, I, I'm, I'm, I think that a lot of people like Kanye who thinks like Kanye, they actually want that period from from 1995 to 2017 back, where the blacks, the whites, and Jews essentially, essentially had. A monopoly over the media. When they had monopoly over the media, they actually could had the ability to control what, how, how the so social constructs of how people uh, thought of each other, how people um, communicated with each other, how people actually interacted with each other. They had the ability to to set up a caste system, which they did. All right, I've always said that that. 
during this period, the blacks, whites, and Jews essentially just pushed their own racial brand. They pushed their own racial brand. They got the best looking 1% of the population to brand themselves. But not only that, but they went out of their way to destroy, to destroy the Asian American brand. They went out of their way to destroy, or at least the very least, um, ostracized any any kind of, ostracized any kind of influence from LGBTs, the, the trans, uh, trans population, Latinos, Arabs, Indian, anybody who wasn't white, black, or Jew. All right, these people, these white, black, or Jews that are in the media, that had that had uh, any kind of power in the media, went out of their way to bash the hell off Asian Americans, Latino Americans, Indian Americans, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, particularly uh, Asian Americans. They set up a caste system that was there. For probably a good 25 years up until 2017. Um, at that point, social media took uh, went into full effect. And, and everybody essentially had a voice instead of the monopoly that these people uh, had. And and I, I I there's a lot of people who don't like that. All right. The 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 Ben Shapiro's of the world. The Kanye West of the world, they're, they're, they're both two sides of the same coin. They actually liked the fact of canceling people because that's what they did. All right. The black race card, the, the anti semi card were used to cancel people, cancel celebrities, cancel certain opinions, cancel voices, etc., etc. All right. Um, there's the civil rights organizations, NWACP, Jesse Jackson, ADL. They exist to push the agenda for whites, uh, the for, for Jews and for blacks, uh, as much as uh, social media, social justice warriors exist to push the agenda for their own people. All right, I'm just giving you guys a background of of, of of the facts here, and these are absolute facts that blacks and Jews created social media, created the blueprint for social media, created the blueprint for pushing an agenda, but. But they, they only like it when, when, when it's used for their own people, for their own people. But when, it, when it's used for other people, other groups, they'll come out and say, well, it's, it's wrong. You know, you shouldn't cancel people's opinions out. You shouldn't, uh, SAW shouldn't exist. There should be no cancel culture. It's, 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 it's a giant hypocrisy. All right. But at least, I, I, I don't know if Kanye has, has admitted this, but at least he goes out of his way to actually voice his opinion on how the Jews use the media to control the population. This is what he's trying to say, control the population, to control social politics, etc., etc. But but in, in, in effect, he actually did admit that he wished that his people did the same thing, but his people did do the same thing. For the last 25 years, the ascension of black people, black culture in this country um, was blacks getting together and pushing their agenda and pushing anybody else out, out everybody else out the way. OK, um, the reason why black people are where they are in 2022, they've had a, a president, they've had uh, they, they have a vice president, they have a huge cultural influence. Was before because of partially because because of their partial monopoly on the media as as much as the Jews and the whites had partial monopoly over the media. The Kardashians was essentially a brainwashing um, a brainwashing show for white women and black dudes. You didn't see you didn't see these pairings. Prior to, 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 to from 20, prior to 20, 1995, 27, you didn't actually, prior to 1995, you didn't actually see these kind of pairings, uh, pairings in the amount that you, 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 you seen them. It's media generated. It's, it's media generated. It's racial branding. It is, is branding of certain images. It's all media generated. Now, what Kanye wants is to go back to that period where he had Monopoly. He had a monopoly. Uh, the blacks had a monopoly as well, the Jews and the whites. But we don't have that anymore. All right. Le the, the gay, lesbian, trans movement has been possibly a bigger civil rights movement than um, a more effective civil rights movement 
than the black civil rights movement. Kanye doesn't like that. All right. The whole social justice warrior culture, the whole cancel cancel culture, the whole social media culture gives a voice to every person, every race, every group of people, every uh, every race group of people that you can possibly imagine. And Kanye doesn't like that. Neither does Ben Shapiro. Neither does a whole lot of people on the right. And 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 a whole lot of people who were democratic, who who were Democrats or, or liberals, who essentially are seeing uh, that you know what, what what's happening. So I, I've always said that a lot of these conservative blacks are were essentially okay with this whole culture of the whole cancel culture, social justice warrior movement, as long as it's civil rights for their own people. Okay, once it became civil rights for everybody else, they now have a problem with it. Ben Shapiro has a problem with it. You know, his people, his people use the race card, the anti-Semite card to cancel people as much as the gays have done, as, as, as much as the women's groups have done. You know, they've done that for decades and decades and decades. So for the last five years, when this whole culture came about, which gave everybody that power, then these people start having issues with the whole cancel culture a paradigm. The, the hypocrisy is amazing. And the fact that nobody is putting it out there, and they should be putting it out there, that that... Blacks and Jews are the original alphabet people, the NWACPADL, and, and they're the original Rainbow Coalition, they're the original social justice warrior movement, they're the original um, cancel culture, they're, they're the original, they're the original social media in that the only social media that actually existed um back in the back in the day. When I say back in the day, I mean like pre- 2017, 1995 to pre 2017, were uh, were TV, movies, TV, movies, uh, music, rap. Rap is race music. I don't listen to rap because it's race music. But let's it. Let's all be serious about what this is. This is essentially a proxy race war. That's been going on for the last 25 years since 1995. This is this is essentially a proxy race war where the media is used as a theater of 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 racial warfare. And it, and, and, I, and I say this because the media has a huge, huge uh, influence on society. How people interact with each other, how people see each other, whether people respect certain people or not. This is all propaganda. All right. Now, do I respect Kanye West for coming out and, and saying this? You know, I, I think at a certain point, when you make a certain amount of money, if you make like you have like two billion dollars, you know, uh, you probably couldn't give a crap about anything else, particularly. If you're in the industry that that you could use, that you could use still use to mold, I mean, he'll always have, he'll always have like the the black, um, the black support. He'll always have the black support, regardless of unless, you know what? He'll he'll still always have a certain amount of black people supporting him, which is a a huge group of black people supporting him. He's got two, he's got two billion dollars. You know, none of this stuff where he's getting canceled for this, this, and this. Um, actually, I, I don't think it will actually affect him, particularly if if um, you're kind of um, if you're like your own person, I guess if if you're the kind of person who don't give a an f <clears throat> about what anybody thinks of you, good or bad, good or bad, that's either good or bad. All right, and you got that kind of f you money. He's just gonna go out and 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 do that, but but he should put it on 
black people and himself as much as he put it on the Jews that that these two groups, including the whites, have essentially used the media as their own propaganda machine for the last for a good 25 years now. It's come to an end. And I, I don't think it's ever going to go back to, 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 to 1995 to 2017. I don't think that air period will ever come back any more than that period from 1995 and previous to that is, is going gonna, is gonna to come back for, for Donald Trump. This country has changed. This country has changed demographically. Um, this con- the, the technology has changed where everybody is given opinion and, 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 and has freedom of speech, like real freedom of speech. I'm not talking about BS freedom of speech where the only thing you could do is talk maybe uh, to, to, to one person next to you. And, 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 and if you say anything different outside of, of, of whatever the culture is, you get ostracized by everybody. So, so, but, but let's all not, let's not, he should just go par, parabolic, par, par, parabolic, parabolic on the media at this point. Because he, the blacks have no control over it anymore than the Jews have any control over it. Any more than any other group has a monopolized control over it. So just come, come out and say that you guys have monopolized and used the media. You guys were essentially cultural soldiers for your race, culture soldiers for your race and your group of people. Because it's obvious, unless you're an idiot, unless you're an idiot and 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 you don't want to admit the facts, it's obvious that the media. Is a propaganda tool for, for, for anybody who wants to essentially put enough money out there to push a certain agenda. But you can't do that now because, because cancel culture exists and everybody has a voice. And everybody is given um, the ability to voice out their discontent, their um, anything that they're not satisfied with. So it, it's a good thing. Cancel culture... Uh, the, the the state of social media is essentially the medium that has given everybody a voice that has ev- that has actually brought freedom of speech to the masses instead of certain corporations that control how you think or what you say instead of maybe a certain uh, couple of groups of races of people who put their agenda out there to promote their race, but then bash the hell out of other people's race for a good 25 years. Look, these people, Kanye, Ben Shapiro, the blacks, the Jews, the whites, you're never going to get this country back where where either one group controls it or three or four groups controls it. The control of society is now given to everybody. 300... And, and, and 60 million Americans now have the ability to, to have freedom of speech. And that is not something that should be looked at as a negative thing. It is a, an absolute positive thing because it manifests the, 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 the freedom of speech uh, that, that, that was envisioned by the forefathers. By the forefathers, by the people who created the Constitution. You know, this is what they meant. Well, we're gonna we're not gonna get get into that because we, we can go down that that um that road and, and and it'll it'll go down for miles and miles and miles. But at this point, uh, everybody should admit that the media is a propaganda tool or has been a propaganda tool used by by a specific a couple of groups, three or four groups, no, three groups, two or three groups from 1995 to 2017. You're never gonna get that period back. You're never going to get that period back, Kanye. You're never going to get that period back, Ben Shapiro. You're not going to ever get that period back. Or you um, cultural... Uh, or you cultural... Uh, or, or you people in the media who were in that period who actually pined for that period of time. And 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 it's a, it's a good thing for America that these people will never get that period back because you will never be able to, again... You know, use the media for for to push your agenda and 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 to use the media also as a terrorist, uh, t- cultural terrorist um, mechanism for 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 a social construct. 